Determining the gender of a fetal pig is fairly simple. We're looking for external physical features that will tell us whether it's a male or female. <coughs> Both male and female pigs have a double row of nipples on the ventral surface so they won't be a distinguishing feature for either males or females since they both have them. So we have to look for other features. The umbilical cord is here and if we look directly posterior to the umbilical cord we'll see that there's actually an opening here. This is a urogenital opening and is only found in the males. In addition to that opening, if we look under the tail we'll also find a single opening which is the anus and also two areas of raised, which is the scrotal sac, and inside there we'd find the testicles. So this pig is a male based on those two features. If we look at a female pig, again, two rows of nipples, so will not help us. If we look posterior to the umbilical cord, there is no urogenital opening here, so that feature is missing. Um, but if we look in the tail area, we will see two openings. Uh, one, we see the anus directly ventral to the tail, and then ventral to that is another flap here, another piece of skin, and this is called the genital papilla, and this is covers the opening to the vagina, so a female has two openings posterior, uh, one the anus, the genital papilla is the one that helps us to identify that it's a female. <coughs>